Hello everybody. I recently picked up this Honda HS80 snowblower. This is a really old machine. I've done some touch-up painting on it and thought I'd share with you what I discovered. First of all, it's sort of hard to make out what's old paint and what's new paint. The side skirt here has been painted new, whereas the uh, section to the left, the rest of the scoop, the non-skirt part, is original paint. And I don't see any substantial difference. The gloss is a little bit different, but then again, uh, the paint's pretty old. This machine's really old. And the paint that I used was the standard, as recommended, Honda Power Equipment Touch-Up Paint. And this is the bright red, 08707-R8, called the bright red. But I also picked up a can of this, Rust-Oleum gloss apple red. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray up two pieces of white paper, one with the gloss apple red, one with the Honda bright red, and let's see how close they are. The Honda bright red is almost $12 before tax, and I believe the Rust-Oleum, I just purchased it at Walmart today, it was uh, under $3.50. I found this chart on the internet this is a little bit dated. It's 2013 American Honda Motor Company. And it talks about oils, chemicals, paint, and fuel cans. And right here, you can see under the red, it says bright red, which is the dash R8 part number, is for early engines, generators, tillers, snow blowers. And you can see that there's the part number right there. Not to be confused with their red, which is called their power red. That is the part number ending in R280, which is used on power equipment. And there you can see the part number. There's a lot of discussion on the internet back and forth about what is the correct color. And based on this chart, I would say that the bright red 08707-R8 is the correct color for a snowblower. Well I don't know how well these are going to show up on the camera but you can see here I took some white envelopes and I painted the one on the left with the Honda bright red and the one on the right with the Rust-Oleum gloss apple red and I would have to say that the shades are very close. In my opinion, the Rust-Oleum 2X Ultra Cover goes on a little bit thicker. It seems to be definitely glossier than the Honda paint. And perhaps the satin version of the Rust-Oleum might be a better match. So the uh, Apple Red is also available in a satin finish. So that will cut down a little bit on the gloss obviously. I also painted this brochure here and again though on the left is the Honda paint on the right is the gloss apple red and again the coverage seems to be better with the Rust-Oleum. I would say that on this paper the finishes look about the same. They're both a little bit glossy but the coverage is definitely better to me with the uh, Rust-Oleum on the right. The color's pretty close. I think close enough that if I ever had any more touch-up work to do on uh, this blower, I would probably use the Rust-Oleum. This experiment here, you can definitely tell the difference in the gloss, uh, but on this different paper, it's, uh, they're pretty similar. I didn't have any scrap metal to, to paint, so perhaps on metal, you'll get even a different result. But the bottom line is, this apple red is pretty close to the Honda bright red. Thanks for watching. Hey, how about a thumbs up if you found this uh, useful or entertaining?